Hello, one community and whoever is watching this. Welcome to my jungle. I mean, my vinyl bar. I'm sorry I haven't been too active lately, but you can't have everything. Therefore, whoever is watching this, I thank you already. But anyway, I thought to make a video about Blondie's new album. In April, April, I already got myself this single. It's a long, long time back with the breaks. And in June, Record Shop X had some campaign and one of the items which they were selling for reduced price was this and because this cost just 7 euros more than the white vinyl LP version I thought that now it's time it's the right time to get it and some of you know me and how I love 7 inch singles. So ladies and gentlemen, here it is, Pollinator. And this version is limited edition 6 piece vinyl set with art cards and it includes download code. Oh, I just listened to it and wrote some down my first impressions about it, the songs. So consider this to be some kind of review video. But first let's take a quick look at the packaging. So here's the box. Lid. And all the singles came with this horrible white inner sleeves and here are the six so-called art cards first one second one Third one, fourth one, fifth one, and finally the sixth one. And then there are six singles. Here's the first one. Second one. Third one. Fourth one. Uh, fifth one. And finally the sixth one and now the review bit a doom or destiny sounds like a classic blondie very good long time also one of the single releases bus driven song a bit disco pretty good this one also has classic blondie elements. Already naked. An average song with little changes. This could have been better. Fun. 
pretty groovy disco driven song. Not bad at all. My Monster. Another song which reminds me of the good old Blondie. And best day ever. This song is below the average, pretty much a filler, though the chorus isn't that bad. Gravity. Another good one. Lots of synths and effects. When I gave up on you. A mandatory ballad. Just okay. With a little changes could have been better. And maybe they tried a bit too hard. Love level. When the song started it sounded like there were a horny horn section blowing in the background. Luckily it didn't last throughout the whole song. Very drum driven song but still an average song. And too much. Very disco song. I love the drums on this one. Pretty close to classic blondie groove. And then the last single, and this is just one sided single. Another, oh sorry, fragments. Another ballad, except it was just the beginning. Then it turned into action song and another good one too very good song to finish an album and if work was mentioned in this song hence the parental but visory sticker on the cover of this box set maybe But then, as I mentioned, about this long time single, it has a song called The Breaks on the B side. And that song is not included in this box set. So I guess it's a bonus track or something. But I wrote that not so good. Not bad. Pretty much, pretty much just an okay song. So, what are my final thoughts about it? First of all, what an unpractical way of listening to an album. But I love this version of it. The album itself was better than I hoped for. I got the feeling that it would be good and it didn't let me down. So my summary thumbs up. So have you heard this album yet and if you have what are your thoughts about it? And what do you think about this kind of album format? If you have any thoughts or comments, you know what to do. And thank you for watching. And let's try to keep in touch. By the way, should I make a video or two about these first six Blondie albums and the best of Blondie albums? Anyway, cheers. The B 
result of the sixth thing or as an etched picture of the pollinator on it. Hope you can see it. So here's a little curiosity piece. This clipping is from Suosiki magazine. It's a number four. 1983 and basically it says an aged Debbie looks that Debbie Harry turned into an old witch after she dyed her hair into brown <laughs> really that bad one more thing how to protect this kind of little box sets. Why not use freezer bag to preserve it? Let's try it out. Box set. Let's add the original inner sleeves and receipt and my little notes. And finally, this thing. And here they are. This kind of protection is better than nothing. Right.